Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to convert binary to decimal when you have a decimal point. So let's say we have the number 103.1415926 and we want to convert that to binary. So the first thing I do is I take I make a little graph here. I put the left side of my decimal on this side, the right side on this side. So, on the left side, let me resituate this, we have 103. The way we do this is we're going to take that number and divide it by 2. When we divide 103 by 2, it will only go in there 51 times. It has a remainder of 1. 51 times 2 would be 102 plus 1, 103. And we keep doing this. So 51 divided by 2 would be 25 again with the remainder of 1 25 divided by 2 would be 12 with the remainder of 1 12 divided by 2 would be 6 with no remainder so we put a 0 6 divided by 2 would be 3 with no remainder. 3 divided by 2, well that's 2 with 1 left over. Sorry, that would be 1. It would equal 2. 1 times 2 is 2 plus 1 equals 3. And then 2 will not go into 1 but there will be a remainder, and now we've hit our zero. And once you hit zero on this side, you can stop. So this is our binary number for 103. So next we go to the other side of the decimal point. This time, instead of dividing by two, we're gonna be multiplying by two. So we take this point one four one five nine two six we multiply that by two and we end up getting zero point two eight three three one eight five two we take this again we multiply by two and we'll get zero point five six six three seven zero four Next, we take this and divide by, I'm sorry, multiply by 2, and we get 1.13276. 1 now, this is where we're going to do a little bit different. Above, we've just been taking the number, timesing by 2, taking the number, timesing by 2, but now that we have a 1 over here, we're not going to take 1.132704. We're going to take that one away and just multiply this side again by 1. I mean, by 2. So we take this. If we multiply this number by 2, we get 0. 2654816. If we multiply that again by 2, we get 0. Five three zero nine six three two. Multiply this by two. We get one zero six one nine two six four. Again, we take the one away. We just multiply this side, and we will get zero one two three eight five two eight. Now with this decimal number, we could go on and on and on forever, but we're just gonna go up to eight bits. And right now I have seven, so I'm gonna multiply one more time 
If I multiply this, I get zero and some number. I really don't care because we're going to stop at this point. Now we have our two sides. And the thing to remember is when you write this number down, we have our binary number. When we start from this side, we go up and read the numbers. We get to the decimal point and we go down and read the numbers. So this number would be 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, point, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0. And that would be our number. Hope this helps. Check out the next video to change this number into a hexadecimal.